a look into the home of the future, perhaps. Maybe you remember the first time you saw a smartphone. It was pretty impressive then, right? Well, some students at UT Arlington are adding smart technology to everyday household items. CBS 11's Jay Gormley tonight shows us how these inventions could save lives. Yvonne Myers is walking a fine line. She's trying to stay independent while battling father time. When I was 65, okay. I just worked through till, till then. Then I started falling apart. <laughs> the 78 year old has undergone back surgery and has had both shoulders replaced. Her 79 year old husband, Hal, is in better shape, but has his own limitations as well. I have Parkinson's. The Myers would love to stay in their apartment and avoid a nursing home. That's where these UT Arlington students come in. They're working on technology that could soon help the Myers and other seniors like them lead longer, more independent lives. Imagine a cane that checks your strength and mobility. How about a cup that takes your blood pressure and heart rate when you grip it? These are just some of the futuristic inventions designed to turn a leisurely day at home into a routine medical checkup. At the bottom is the same kind of pressure sensors. It's called Smart Care, where sensors are attached to common household items. In theory, the sensors collect and record medical data and then send it to a doctor or other care facilities. Something so simple as staring into a mirror can provide valuable medical information. For instance, this mirror takes a picture of your face and analyzes skin color, which is a key factor in checking blood circulation. Rather than you going to a doctor's office for a physical to allow your environment to take your physical every single day, um, analyze it, and if there is something unusual in it, provide that information to the doctor. For instance, UTA researchers are working on a floor that analyzes your balance and can even report if you have fallen. So something that can kind of watch that over for them and manage it would help them stay independent at home much longer and safely. These household items with smart technology are being developed through a partnership between UTA's College of Nursing and its College of Engineering. Testing the technology is scheduled for the beginning of 2013 at the Lakewood Village Senior Apartments in Fort Worth. Well, I think it's great. You see, Lakewood Village is where the Myers call home and where their apartment may one day become their own personal doctor's office. Jay Gormley. CBS 11 News. And the UTA Smart Care Project is being paid for with $800,000 in federal grant money.